things that we have to correct. And uh, with that, I'll open it up for questions. Darrell? Uh, yeah, Coach, if you talk about getting that one yard this week on Turner's <laughs> run, uh, uh, when you needed it the most there with everything going kind of bizarre for you? Well, we were able to uh, we were able to get some movement and we were able to get uh, you know that precious one yard and they're hard to come by. Uh, it was blocked correctly. The uh, offensive line did a nice job and uh, Michael was able to you know to step in. And again, it's a fine line each and every week when you play uh, you know when you play in the National Football League. And that's a very good football team. My hat's off to them. They played us very, very tough. Coach, you say you got a couple of things, well, a few things to correct. Give me a couple. A couple? Well, I can tell you we uh, <laughs> I, I, we can't turn the ball over the way we turn the ball over, obviously. Uh, you can't be minus four in the turnovers and, and normally you're not win games. That doesn't happen very often in the, in the National Football League. We've got to find a way to quit misfitting and giving up big runs, and we've got to find a way for the coach not to throw a challenge flag at, a, at the wrong time. <laughs> and I can assure you that one will be addressed very quickly. Co coach, how does this team, after the loss in New Orleans, after everything that came with it, how does this team come out so lethargic to start the game, it seems? I wish I knew the answer to that. We were kind of sleepwalking through the, uh, through the first quarter of the football game. And uh, it shows our resiliency. That's what it shows. We have, we're a very resilient football team that uh, is going to find different ways to win. And uh, to be successful in the, in the NFL, you're going to have to win games a lot of different ways. And uh, today, we found another way to do it. And that was uh, to play some really good defense and some short fields.